이제 시작하겠습니다. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. So, Carol, are you ready to go now? Dad, wait a second, please. I just need to pack a few more things. All right. I'll wait, but you'd better hurry up. There's not much time left until the bus arrives. 2번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Matt, have you decided what club you want to join? Not yet. I'm thinking of joining either the Webtoon Club or the Photography Club. The Webtoon Club is only for first graders. Second graders like us are not able to join that club. 3번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, could you go buy a bag of flour? A bag of flour? Sure. But I think there should be some flour left on the upper shelf. There is only a little left. We need more for dinner this evening. 4번. 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, listeners. Welcome to One Minute Insights. Did you know that walking is good not only for your body, but also for creative thinking? Take Steve Jobs as an example. He was known to hold meetings while taking a walk when he needed to come up with fresh ideas. Also, a group of researchers compared people trying to think of new ideas while they were walking or sitting. They found that creativity levels were much higher for those walking compared to those sitting. Therefore, the next time you need a creative idea, why don't you try taking a walk? I'll be back with another insightful tip tomorrow. Stay tuned. 5번. 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, students. I'm Mr. Park, your vice principal. It has been only two weeks since the first floor bathroom renovation was finished. This morning, I found that the floor was littered with toilet paper and someone had scribbled on the wall. You should remember the bathroom is a public facility. I know you take good care of your classrooms. I want you to keep our bathrooms clean the same way. Thank you for your kind understanding. 6번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 주장으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Emily, can I keep the book that I borrowed from you a few days longer? Sure. It's a good book, isn't it? I love it, but it's taking me a long time to read it. I wish I read faster. Maybe I should sign up for a reading program. Hmm. I don't agree with you. Why not? Well, I think you should focus more on comprehension rather than on speed. The point of reading books isn't how fast you read them. That makes sense. As long as you don't have any problems understanding the content, why bother trying to read quickly? Try to concentrate on understanding the content. Okay. Thanks for the advice, Emily. 
1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Julia, I've noticed that you've been less talkative recently. Is everything okay? Not really, Dad. I've been feeling stressed these days. You know, a lot of homework and preparing for the exam. That's what I thought. I've been thinking about what could help you with your stress. How about drawing? I've never thought about it before. Why do you recommend doing that? It's because drawing helps you reduce stress. Really? How so? It's known that the activity of drawing can lower the levels of stress hormones in our bodies. Oh, I didn't know that. There's more. Drawing is also helpful for relieving stress because it lets us express our feelings. That makes sense. Sometimes it's hard for me to express negative emotions. I think drawing could help. You should try it out. 8번 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello. How can I help you? Hello. I'm wondering if you could repair my high heel shoes. Oh, the heel is broken. Sure. I can replace it with a new one. Great. It broke when my shoe got stuck in a manhole cover and I fell down. Oh, no. Did you get hurt? No. I was pretty embarrassed, though. How much is it to repair it? It costs ten dollars, and it'll take about two hours. I'm quite busy right now with previous orders. That's okay. I need to go to the post office anyway. If you leave your number, I'll give you a call as soon as it's ready. Perfect. Here's my number. Thank you. 9번. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. Number 1. I'd like to buy a bike for my child. How old is your child? Number 2. Wow, your bike looks great. Thanks. It's brand new. Number 3. My bike tire needs air. Can I use your hand pump? Of course. Feel free to use it. Number four. Would you teach me how to ride a bike? Sure. Follow my instructions. Number five. Where should we ride to today? Let's go to Central Park this time. 10번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자에게 부탁한 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, we have three hours until Anna's birthday party. Right. Let's have a final check before people start coming. Okay. The party table is set up nicely in the living room. What about the cake? It arrived this morning. I put it in the refrigerator. Great. Oh. We need to pick up birthday balloons from the party shop. No worries. They'll be delivered soon. Then I should go and pick up my parents at the train station. Good. Oh, I forgot to buy some drinks. Can you buy some on the way back home? I'll take care of that. See you soon. 11번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 야구 경기를 보러 갈수 없는 이유를 고르시오. Hello. Hi, Judy. I missed your call. The market here is a bit noisy, so I couldn't hear my phone ringing. Oh, if you're busy, we can talk later. No, I'm not. 
I've just finished shopping for ingredients for my restaurant. We can talk now. Okay. The Hawks baseball team has a game at 6 p.m. next Tuesday. Do you want to go with me? I'm afraid I can't. I have something else I need to do. I thought your restaurant was closed every Tuesday. Did you change the schedule? No. Actually, my staff and I have to develop a new menu for the upcoming season. It's already getting hot, so I need to hurry up. I wish you luck. Maybe next time. Hello, Ms. Tiffin. Hello, Mr. Morgan. I'm here to pick up the coat I dropped off the other day. Oh, here it is. Try it on. Okay. The length of the sleeves is perfect now. Thanks. How much is it? It's $30. Could I have these shirts dry cleaned as well? I have four shirts in total. Yes. Each shirt costs $3 to dry clean. Great. Is it okay to pay for the shirts in advance? Sure. Why not? Then I'll pay for the coat and the shirts with a credit card now. Thank you. Here's your receipt. You can pick up your shirts after 5 p.m. tomorrow. Okay. I'll stop by then. 13번. 대화를 듣고 나폴리 키친에 관해 언급되지 않은 것을 고르시오. Honey, let's go out for lunch. How about going to Napoli Kitchen? Napoli Kitchen? I've never heard of it. Well, it opened in 2021. It has started gaining popularity recently. Aha! It must be Italian. Right. The restaurant serves authentic Italian cuisine. It has three cooks who are all native Italians. They're incredibly passionate about their food. Great. I'd love some real Italian pizza. Is it far from our house? Not really. It's a five-minute drive. It's next to Benny's Bakery on Oak Street. I see. It's almost 10 now. Let's have an early lunch. Well, their business hours are from 11 to 9. We'll have to wait a little. Then I think the timing would be perfect if we do the laundry before we go. Okay, let me bring my dirty clothes down. 14번 스쿨 블럭 컨테스트에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Hello students. This is your art teacher Ms. Garcia. This year our school will hold the school vlog contest. Students who want to participate in this contest should make a video on the theme of true friendship. Only videos taken in our school will be accepted, and they must not be longer than five minutes. Students will vote to choose the winning video. The winner will receive a trophy and a gift certificate. Remember, the deadline is May 15th, and videos should be submitted by email to vlogcontest at edu.com. For more information, please visit me in person. Thank you. 15번 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주문할 즉석 카메라를 고르시오. Honey, look at this. Jack's Electronics has a special promotion on instant cameras. Why don't we buy one? That's nice. Let's choose one together. 
I don't think we can spend more than one hundred fifty dollars. I agree. What about the color? Do you have any preference? Hmm. I don't like black. Me neither. Do you think we need a flash function? Yes, I heard it's necessary. Okay, then we have two choices. Why don't we buy this one with a leather case? It's a little more expensive, but it's worth the extra money. Good. Then let's order that camera now. Sixty-six. 번대화를듣고남자의마지막말에대한여자의응답으로가장적절한것을고르시오 Tiffany. The drone competition is finally taking place next week. That's right, John. You've already signed up for it, right? Yeah. How about you? Well, I wanted to, but I can't. Why? You've been looking forward to it for quite a long time. I know, but I have to skip the competition because I have an important job interview next Thursday. Wait. Do you think the drone competition is next Thursday? Yes, the competition announcement said it'll be held next Thursday. Tiffany, it was rescheduled to next Friday. Let me show you. Check this notice on their website. Oh, I didn't know that. Is it still possible to sign up? Yes, but only until 5 p.m. today. You'd better hurry up. Seventy-seven. 번대화를듣고여자의마지막말에대한남자의응답으로가장적절한것을고르시오 Mr. Robinson, could I talk to you for a minute? Sure, Amy. What's up? It's about the schedule for my presentation next week. Okay, I remember you're making your presentation next Friday, right? Yes. Could I change the date of my presentation if you don't mind? Oh, can you tell me why? There will be an international robot fair on Friday, so I really want to go there. I see. When would you like to give your presentation? On Thursday. Let me see. Kevin is making his presentation on Thursday. If he can make it on Friday instead, you can give yours on Thursday. Actually, I asked Kevin, and he said he can. Seventy-eight. 다음상황설명을듣고세라가미스터스미스에게할말로가장적절한것을고르시오 Sarah and her husband plan to fly to see her friend in Jeju with their one and a half year old son Jimmy. Sarah is trying to buy their airline tickets. Her husband says that Jimmy can fly for free because of his age. She is not sure he's right. Because they have never traveled with Jimmy on a plane, so she wants to ask Mr. Smith, the travel agent, under what age a child can travel on a plane for free. In this situation, what would Sarah most likely say to Mr. Smith? 19번과20번다음을듣고물음에답하시오 Good morning, class. You need to present your project next week. Today, I'd like to introduce you to some types of visual aids that can make your presentation more effective. The first one is whiteboards. Whiteboards are a great aid when you have to explain complex ideas, like putting difficult words in context or showing the steps in a process. Handouts are also powerful aids. If you give your audience key information on printed paper, 
They'll understand you more clearly. Video clips can be a great tool as well. They're effective in engaging your audience and they also add variety to your presentation. Lastly, try to use charts. There are many types of charts, so choose the most suitable one to convey your points. Keep these in mind to help you make a great presentation next week. 19번. 여자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Twenty-one. Unknown. 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 Unkn